Good afternoon, traders. It is Thursday, June 5th, 2014, and U.S. stock market is closed. What a day today. We had probably uh, one of the best, if not the best, day that I've seen trading in, in, in over a year. Uh, you know, before I became a trader, I was a psychologist. And one of the paradoxes about studying people and anxiety is that people who uh, experience a lot of anxiety often experience this anxiety when good things happen. And I'm going to tell you, I'm just a basket case today. I can't remember being so uptight as today. And it was a great day. But other traders often act the same way. That has been my uh experience when you make a ton of money uh, your your anxiety levels just go through the roof and yet sometimes when you lose money it's, it's just kind of like well you know we'll get it back maybe <laughs> it's tough to make a lot of money like today uh, it, it just you, you don't know if you've done good or not anyway enough of that blah blah uh, we closed out uh, almost $19,000 in uh, closeout trades today. We're carrying almost $30,000 in open trade equity uh, going into tomorrow. So you don't only add it up. We're, we're getting close to $50,000 gain today. Uh, I did take one screenshot. I, uh, three and a quarter hours into the day, we were just over $60,000. That's, that's, that's just an amazing amazing uh, trip today. Uh, Dow Jones Industrial Average is at all-time record highs today. Never been higher than today. It gained 98 points. Um, you know, you, you can believe what you want and what caused big uh, push today, but basically uh, they cut in interest rates in Europe to negative, kind of made it so that banks are holding money. Uh, they have to pay a tax on it. So that's to make the banks want to lend the money out to businesses and individuals. And of course, that is definitely uh, causing, will cause some stimulation in those economies. And we just followed through on that. Uh, when the markets opened today, uh, you know, things were really good. I, I, I just can't say <laughs> enough good things about this bull market. And this is not going to stop, folks. I mean, this is just going through the roof. Anyway, let me show you the chart. Okay, we're looking at the Dow here. and I mean, <laughs> you just look at this thing just really shot up. And as I say, those are all-time record highs. Um, and you know, you know what I really love about this is I remember trading back in 2012. And it was a very difficult year to trade. And it seemed like everything... Uh, that happened with the Dow happened the first 15 minutes and then the market was just trade sideways after that and so you, if you didn't do what you were going to do the first 15 20 minutes you were just left in the dust well you notice what this market has been doing it's moving all over the place this morning it uh, it opened positive then it went negative and then it slingshot out of this this negative position again buyers coming in to buy lows and just shot the thing way 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 up uh, we were up I think hundred and five points at the very top there and it pulled back a little bit 98 points pretty close to the high great just just great action on the Dow there that's just fantastic and that is going to propel us to uh, not only propel the Dow to unbelievably new highs I believe it's going to provide you know propel my equity also uh, very very good I'll show you just a few uh, you know we we got into a bunch of trades today and I picked uh, Bita to show you here just because it's pretty typical we got into this um, after you know maybe two hours or so and it we pretty much kept going we're holding about um, two thousand dollars in Bita and we have a whole bunch of those trades. We have a whole bunch of trades that we are holding like somewhere 
between a thousand and two thousand dollars in uh, all very nice and, and you add them all up that's a lot of money as I say we're we're, we're actually carrying almost thirty thousand dollars into tomorrow um, I'll show you uh, a, another another good one here this was in Nova Gold this guy surprised me because I usually think gold moves inversely to the stock market but it sure wasn't today uh, we had bought this yesterday it didn't do anything for us but look at this thing just really gapped up this morning and we're holding uh, over three thousand dollars in Nova Gold now I will show you the market that has me uh, twitching turning sweating I just don't know what to do about this <laughs> This is, uh, and uh, let's see if I can find it here. This is going, I'm sorry, there we go. This is Unipixel. Hey, and I showed this yesterday. I showed you what a nice little trip here we got in here and it went way up here. Well, look what happened today. This thing just blasted into the stratosphere. And the reason I'm uptight about this, right here where we are right now, we're holding over sixteen thousand dollars in open trade equity in Unipixel. Now that's really great, but we were up to up right right here. We were up to like twenty-two thousand, and I think it was close to twenty-four thousand up here. So you know, <laughs> we got to hold this thing tomorrow. We might have to hold this for four to five hours tomorrow, and. God, I don't want to see this thing sell off. I want to take profits in this so bad, but I can't. You know, trade the system. The system is what got us in down here. I can't betray the system now. But, oh, I want to get out of this and take all those big, nice thousands and thousands of dollars and take it and run. But I'll stick with the system. You know, I... I it could fade, you know, it could fade. We had um, mankind fade from $9,000 this morning all the way down to $4,000. That hurt. And this could fade too. But you know, the other thing is, this could turn out into a massive short squeeze tomorrow too. And we could benefit from it. So we play the system. We do what we're supposed to do. Hey, we're doing great. Anyway, that's... Uh, Fantastic day today. This is Trader Bob signing off. I'll see you tomorrow on Friday.